Okay. Hi, everybody, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Katrina, and I am Cat and Moon Budgets. Today, we're going to be doing a sinking fund challenge in my variable bills. And we're also going to do some games um, because I have a little bit extra, actually quite a bit extra this time. So I want to do some savings challenges that I don't normally do. So we're going to start off by counting this. So we're going to do 50, 100. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 320, 330, 340, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 400, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. That's not right. Hold on. Okay, 100. Thirty, forty. About 440. 60, 60, 70, 70, 80, 90, 90, 500, 500, 50, 50, 50, 25. 30, she said she said she did it but so my bank was really busy today and they like ran out of tens somehow so i had to get a lot more fives than i asked for but it's still the right amount okay so the first thing that we're gonna do like i said is the saving challenges but first i want to do the save opoly one that I bought from Sav Budgets, I believe it was. And it came with this really cool dropping stuff. Um, it came with its own die. I'm going to get that out because, you know, I just have to use what it came with. This binder doesn't want to stay open. I don't think I really have anything to keep it open either. I don't know what that is. Okay. Sorry, somebody was calling me and I didn't recognize the number. So I'm just like, put my phone on do not disturb. So I don't know what just happened with audio wise, but so we're going to do save Opoly and um, I got to make room here. Okay, so we're going to do Save Opoly, and this one I believe was from Sav Budgets. I'll have to double check and put the right one on there. So I have $100 to go towards the savings challenge. So let's just get the 100 out. Two, three, four, five. I think I did 10. Six, seven, eight, nine. I think I did 10 in ones. Five, 10, 15, 20. Let's do most of them in ones. So I know I for sure had two 20s for the challenge. So 40, 60. Okay, so let's make sure we have 100 here. Just so I don't go over budget of what I allowed myself for. And if my brain is all skewy, it's because my brain literally is all skewy. We got 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90. Ooh. 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90. So I did grab two and five. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 is 100. Okay, that way I don't get confused. So we're going to start with Opoly. So I believe you just like roll the die and move around starting from go. So you got three. So one, two, three. So we got seven. Okay. Let me zoom in for you guys. I don't think you need to see the money, but I'd like you to see the board. So I landed on this red one here. So we got seven. So I'm going to put a pink dot. So we're going to roll again. We got five. One, two, three, four, five. We got eight dollars. We got fifteen, so we'll go again. We got four. One, two, three, four. Chance, pick one to a hundred. So we're going to go like this. Ask Alexa for a number between one and a hundred. 
Hey, Alexa, give me a number between 1 and 100. Did she say 33? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to stop there. Um, I'm going to write 33 on there. So we got, where's my calculator? So we have 33 plus 15, $48. So we're going to flip this over. I'm bumping stuff because I'm doing this very awkwardly. So we're going to do 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 36, 47, 48. Well, that was quickly escalated. I mean, it could have been worse. She could have told me 100 and then I would have been IOUing $15. So that was actually kind of fun. I like these. I'm going to have to do these more often. So then we're going to backtrack and we're going to do the windy road which I have designed and it is in my Etsy shop. Okay, so it's in my Etsy shop as the savings game bundles where you get the witchy library, the windy road, which is similar to the game of life. And then you get not Etris, which is not Tetris, just so it's copy not copyrighted. And then there's an Among Us one, but I don't know where the board for that went. Um, so windy road says grab a die pick a starting road and roll the die and move that many spaces and save that much money in my envelope So I got the inspiration from this when Tracy at golden girl budgets did like her path one and I don't know Who designed that one for her, but I really liked it and so it made me think of like the game of life and so I just designed my own um We'll just zoom in and if I get down below. So we'll just start up here since that's what you guys can see. And I rolled a six. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five. Um, actually, you know what? We're going to do that different. We're going to go around and go off the road and then come back down. Got one, two, three, four, five, six. So this space says, save $4 for being awesomely you. So we're gonna just put an X through that one. And we got $4, which we'll grab my calculator again and I'll just put a four on there. And then we'll roll again. I wanna hit my pen. So it rolled off camera, but it's a three. Um, no, I'm going to zoom this up to one and just leave it like that. Um, so we got a three, so we're going to go one and go over here, two, three. Save five dollars if you told a joke today. I did not tell a joke today, I don't think. <gasps> yes, I did. I did tell a joke today. So I was at work and I told um, a dad joke of some kind. Um, this man was walking and his foot was dragging behind and I made a comment about his foot like being in telling it to get in line with the other one and he started dying laughing and he's like do you like do that for a living and I was like no no I don't but he said like it's kind of funny because in he was a military man so like in the military they told him to walk in a line and my joke of telling his foot to get in line with the other one just made him laugh. And he found it funny like a joke. So I'm counting that as a joke. So we did nine. So we'll do... Mm, I don't know if I want to... We'll roll one more. Three. One, two, three. The age you met your first love. Ooh. Can I not admit that one? Because that's kind of a pricey one. Um, actually, no, it's not. Yeah, I'm not going to count crush. Um, so, yeah, I was 15 when I first met that bad person. 
got 15, 20, 24, yeah, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4. Yeah, I was not, that was one person I should have stayed away from. Um, was my high school boyfriend long term. He ended up cheating on me with my best friend. No good piece of junk. So anyway, we're going to go to the witchy library. And basically, this is another one that I designed in my shop, which, oh, goodness. Um, this one's in my shops, which I'll link in the description box as well. It's all in the same file, so I'll just link it with the listing. Um, so basically, I pick a shape or roll a die between object types. Pick a shape. Oh, yeah, so I can pick, like, these shapes. Um, a roll a die between object types, which I'm going to do that. And then you watch your library turn to colors, as you save, like, it's magic. So these are the values of the books, and then these are the values of the cauldron and everything. So there's, like, different things, which I'll show you, but they have a value with them. And you can save a total of $201 with this challenge. And so we're going to come over here, not that one. So this is the witchy library, which I did count. I did not count the candle or anything. So the candle is just a bonus. And so are these like crystals at the top. That's just a bonus. But these are the items you can do. So we're going to roll a die. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I have one through nine. So if I get a 10, 11, or 12, I'm just going to go back through the list. Oh, wait, I can't. I need two die. Okay. Here we go. I'll just roll a d20. So 13. So we have... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... 10, 11, 12, 13, a spell book, which is $10, which I do have. So the spell book is the one that says spells on it. So we're just going to color this in. I am not worried about it being perfect and super colorful. I am not staff saves. Um, yeah, she does her coloring like spectacular. She'll do like multiple colors in the thing. Me, I'm not that heavy. Uh -huh. Funny me. Anyway, so we're going to do another one. I got 5, 10, 15, 16, 17. I got 18 left. So I think that's what we're going to We're going to roll again. So I got a 12. So that would have been the laying down book. We're going to grab my markers here and use these ones because... My permanent marker went through. Okay, so a laying down book is like right here underneath the plant. We'll make that one green. Okay, so we have that one's five dollars, so we'll throw another five dollars in there. Um, so I think that's all I'm going to do for that one. I want to go back to the Savopoly. I have a little bit left. We'll push my luck. We'll go back to Savopoly. After I put my witchy library money in. So I ended up doing 15 in that one. Okay, so I have 10, 11, 12, 13. I have $13 left for Savopoly. So we're going to hope it's good to us. We left off on chance. So we'll roll again. So I got a three. So we got one, two, three. So that's $5. Now, every time I do this, I'll do it in a different color. So that way, I know. What is that? Roll die card. Hold on. 
say if x is times 2 yeah no i don't know what that means i don't have to look at the instructions for this because i did not come with the instructions so i was like i'm kind of curious now what that means but okay so we'll roll again roll the five so we got one two three four five five dollars all right so i'm gonna stop there because the next few ones are like expensive we left off on the five, so that one's a roll two times double amount. Nine dollars twenty-five ten community chest, which is that one. Um, yeah, no, thank you. I do not have enough for that one. So then the last put these five or this ten into save Opoly. So for save Opoly, we saved a total of twenty, thirty, thirty-five. 40, 45, 50, 55, 6, 57, 58. So that took over half of our money, which is fine. It's fun. I rather enjoy Saveopoly. Um, so yeah, we'll go this way to the 50 envelope challenge. And I just happen to have a three left. So we will add that in. 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. So we got 41 in here. I don't know if I'll need any more ones, but I shouldn't. And I'm not going to condense this one unless it's like becoming absolutely massive. Okay, so we're at 18 minutes, so I'm going to stop this one, and then I'll do my sinking funds in the next video. So be sure to check out my Etsy shop for the Witchy Library, the Windy Road, and the other games that I have in there. Um, and I'll link that in the description below, and then I will see you in the second part. So you guys have a great night. If you don't watch the second part, I will catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.